Now, this is kind of simple today. If things aren't sounding right to you, get your hearing checked. I did. Now, let's go on a visit with the good folks at Johnson Audiology. When you come to our office for a hearing test, it's a relaxed environment, it's a simple procedure. We try to get to know you and the problems that you're having. Then we put you in the booth and complete the testing. We go over the results when we're done and we talk about any recommendations that we need to make. It's truly just a simple way to know more about your hearing and what you can do to have better hearing help. If you're experiencing any of the following problems, it might be a good idea to have your hearing tested. Some of the most common symptoms or first signs that we see of hearing loss include having a hard time hearing people in noisy situations, thinking people mumble, turning your television up loudly, or not being able to hear very well on the telephone. A complete diagnostic hearing evaluation allows us to determine what type of hearing loss you have. As soon as you start noticing problems with your hearing, you want to go ahead and have the hearing test completed. The sooner we can diagnose you with hearing loss and get you treatment, the better you'll do in the long run and the better quality of life you'll have. A complete diagnostic hearing evaluation will include otoscopy when we look in your ears to determine if there's any wax that needs to be removed before we move forward with other testing. As you can see with Don, we begin by looking in his ears to make sure his ear canals are clear of wax. Did you ask any questions? I didn't hear any of them. <laughs> then we move on to looking at his mental ear function to make sure there's no hole in his eardrum or ear infection. As you can see with Don's testing, um, it's a very simple and non-invasive procedure. Yes, why? <laughs> Is that not good? No. Really? No more q -tips. When we put you in the booth, we'll put the headphones over your ears and we'll give you a button to push when you hear the beep. What we're trying to d determine is the softest level that you can hear that beep across the frequency region. This gives us the severity of your hearing loss, how severe it is from mild to profound. A full diagnostic hearing evaluation can generally be done in less than 15 minutes. Then we move forward with the speech testing. We do a speech reception threshold, which gives us the softest level that you can hear a word and repeat it back to me. Then we do word recognition testing, where we present it at a loud but comfortable level. And this gives us an indication of if we can get it loud enough for you by wearing a hearing aid, how well can you hear the words and repeat them back to me? This gives us a good prognostic indicator of how well you'll do with your hearing aids. After we complete the full test, we of course will go over the results with you so that you know exactly what's going on with your hearing loss, what that means for you, and what type of recommendations we'll make at that point. As soon as you start noticing problems with your hearing, it's best to go ahead and have a hearing test done. The speech sounds that you're missing, so you're missing a lot in the high frequencies, some in the mid, and some even in the lower frequencies. Normal conversation occurs about 50. So, this is your hearing loss, and you are a good candidate for hearing aids. Hey. <laughs> Do what? Your ears are like any other muscle in your body. If you don't lose, use it, it loses its ability to function. So if we're not stimulating our ears with auditory input from our environment, the brain forgets what to do with that information. So the sooner you can get treatment for your hearing loss through hearing aids, the better you will do and the more speech understanding you will get from your hearing aids, which is the ultimate goal of wearing a hearing aid. Well, I guess I could say I failed the test, but maybe that's good news. Well, actually, I know that it is because now I know what can and can't be done and all that good stuff. And we'll be going through that a little bit more, I'm sure, someday down the road. Dr. Courtney Guthrie, doctor of audiology, and uh, getting my hearing checked. And be sure to stay tuned next month uh, when the good folks at uh, uh, Johnson Audiology, 1618 Gunbarrel Road, Suite 102, uh, we go through a diagnosis, okay? There's their phone number, 423-710-1432, 710-1432.